greetings to you welcome into the channel thanks so much for tuning in and in this message we are taking a look at what is going on with the collective remember to take these messages as entertainment <clears throat> take what applies for you and leave the rest alone thanks so much for all of your show of support on this journey so let's start on the bottom of the deck, we have the Ten of Diamonds, and it's, it's feeling good, like your dream is coming true. You're making some progress here. This may be about money, inheritances, insurance. Um, this could also be about love manifesting in your life. You're having some positive breakthroughs. You're pulling away from karmic, karmic energies too within yourself and from other people in your surroundings. This could be like exes, um, family members, toxic traits and habits that were not serving you. You're successfully pulling away back to your natural self. And someone is also seeing that you're moving away and they're losing control of, of you. Right? Like the energy of you moving away and someone reaching out their hand to grab you back and but you're too far gone and this person they feel um aggravated and they feel upset gossip now there's something about them talking about you your exes there's something about the police also so if you're interested in knowing more about that exploring more just um message me communicate it to me in some way all right thanks for leaving your comments your likes your subscribes on the channel Let's see. In another video, we'll look at who is gossiping about you. Collective. Yeah, because I feel like a lot of people are talking about you. Six of Swords, for sure. Um, like, you are very important. VIP. Uh, something about your mindset. You also do things your own way, on your own, in your own timing. People may also say you don't care. So, for the collective... There is a clearance coming in, a truth, a confirmation that is coming in wisdom for all of, for the, like for the entire collective. Let's see what this truth is. It's really coming in and you're moving into calmer waters. What is the truth for the collective? Trust your instincts. Something about going shopping, pairing back with the money energy of ten of diamonds you're gonna get some blessings a level up or like a check look abundance some money in your hand some of some of you your way will be paved um or made some of you you're moving into stardom you wanted a particular role uh let's say you were you're an actor an actress and you were auditioning for something you're gonna get through that's the energy you may even get a call today, I'm feeling like, with the Six of Swords, someone showing up. Let's see who is showing up. Could be a mother. It could be someone that was talking about you. And there's something about jail. Someone could be released. And you're going to find out the truth about what someone has been talking about you with the release card. Prayer. And there are people talking about you. Um like they're surmising like they're saying like they talk about you like they know you like they're saying you know that she was <clears throat> she, this is what she wanted out of life yeah you know that she had a big dream or you know that she had a car or she wants a car so <laughs> that's the energy people are talking about your wishes or your hopes or your vision with the ten of diamonds you know that she wanted to get married and have children like so this could be people close to you i don't necessarily feel it is negative or evil intentions but they are talking about you for real like you are the focus of some people's attention joy and it is because you you are full of energy full of life you are unique like i was saying earlier there is no one like you and you're gonna get recognition for some of you you're gonna get in some information about your birth <coughs> about like from you came into birth your birth mother your birth parents or some answer that you've always wanted, you're going to get that. You're going to get that today coming in. Six of Swords. Wow, I see checks, big money coming in for you today. Wow, it's like it is unstoppable rejection. Like you cannot be stopped is how I'm feeling like. I just feel like your way have been paved. Something is making, is making its way onto you. I'm toward you. 
and i'm getting like you may win you may feel like you win some and lose some but what you win is powerful you're, you're pleased impartiality something about gates and things working out in your favor what is the knight of pentacles for the collective soulmate soulmate energy right your soulmate is coming through your dream is coming through a twin flame right connection is manifesting for you something soulful something real like i say um someone may have trespassed in some way but i just feel they're getting restoration so be be on the lookout for that it may have taken a while with the knight of pentacles it took a lot of work um it was maybe something intricate or detailed or something having to do with paperwork anything like that it took a while to manifest but it is here for you six of swords joy it's about to bring you joy um for some time for some of you this is in the morning like joy coming in the morning your isolation is over something about ice cream and your loneliness is over the sadness is over some of you something is coming in the springtime for you all right destiny it's meant to happen something about books so you may be booking more customers you may be writing books but i feel like it's bookings going back to someone that auditioned um you may be getting popular on social media as well yeah impasse it's a part of your destiny like something was written it was meant for you but somehow yeah it's soulmate soulmate and enlightenment but somehow i feel like it took a while to manifest completion maybe you were completing a cycle so i'm feeling like a cycle is over and you're receiving some rewards service for your service for some of you this is you standing up and speaking the truth using your mouth and no weapons formed against you shall prosper no one shall come to confuse you because um you are least you're you're clairvoyant and you hear the truth you know what is real to you but it's like someone wanted to take your power and they wanted you to be disempowered and they wanted you to be okay with that so the minute you started to stand up for yourself to speak up for yourself to know who you are know your worth ask for more put in the work for yourself and you started to take your power back from these groups these entities these people whether they be exes ex-employers ex-co-workers ex-friends um parents family members whatever whoever thought they had you underneath their thumb you're moving away they don't like that there's something about a car what's with a car angels spirits guides for the collective what's with the car energy i hear gratuity or graduation so it may have been a gift a gift for you that you did not receive or maybe you are you it took a while for you to receive it yeah you may have felt like it wasn't gonna come true rejection because this is something you may have been wanting but you're i just feel the rejection card is coming up but i feel like perseverance like you're not gonna give up it just it just does not feel like rejection it feels like a delay four of swords yeah i hear principles okay and a lot of truth meditating relaxing sleeping yeah your dream is coming true i just feel like that what is the night night of cups night of pentacles and those of you who are looking to reconnect in love where there was a disconnect this there's there's this person coming to make up ten of wands is next ten of wands is showing me like struggle stress and strain the ten of wands shows someone <coughs> so the ten of wands shows someone that is having a really like difficult time maybe shame disgrace humiliation you're feeling unburdened but i feel like you're, you're flipping the script you know you're taking your power back for real like that is the energy i'm getting and you're doing it like discreetly or unexpectedly the magician yeah, because there was someone that was trying to like pressure you. Someone was trying to defame another person. And this is what we've been saying. So if you're a part of the collective that has been going through defamation, that I've been waiting for your justice, waiting for something to settle, you're about to have that settling. But it's something that you had to stand up for. You had to have strength 
determination courage boldness in order to pull this off and like ease this burden and stress up off of you some some of you you had like this not um this dirty energy upon you it, it just feels like you were manifesting negative energy but it wasn't of your own accord it was like put on you for you to struggle be outcasted not be manifesting living um in a toxic connection with someone not knowing yourself that's how they wanted to keep you feeling mentally so that you would continue to manifest stressful situations so that they could continue to take your power <clears throat> someone just wanted to continue to disempower you and they're learning that you have a wit about you yeah you have so much faith it was like unbelievable to this person for real the amount of strength you have um because like you were up against 10 or you were up against one against the many with the ten of ones energy and there was this big boss like a mastermind energy that sent out these energies after you right destiny but they didn't know i'm getting something about um the, a part in the bible about the writing on the wall with this destiny card because they did not know that you had vigor in you you had a roar you had you you were just like gonna break the chains <clears throat> that kind of energy where you're someone that can you, you like if you get really angry and get to your wits end you're like roar and break the chains someone did not expect that and you t it's like you you um you dismantle all of the weapons that were formed against you. So this is why this person is going back to the beginning where I'm saying they, or throughout the reading where I was saying they feel like intimidated. They feel kind of afraid because they realize that they no longer have you chained. They no longer have you castrated. They no longer have you disconnected from source. They no longer have you disconnected from money. They no longer have you struggling and stressing. So this person is stressing now because they realize that you're coming for their food straight to them because you've cleared the way from all of the weapons that they formed against you you have like um overcome them because you are the strongest like samson your fate is so strong with the, with the like and god has been supporting you all this time the most time forgiveness now this person they want forgiveness now they're asking you for forgiveness better believe me there's someone out here asking you to understand them because you know what you know why this person is asking you for forgiveness because they know that they won't be able to withstand what they put you through they are afraid someone is like literally like so scared insecure what they put you through they're afraid of it um happening to them i promise you all right so they want to come to you that's why i say the six of swords is someone trying to move toward you as well right something about notion they want to make a move toward you and i'm um, like like make a truth or something because whatever is happening to them that's backfiring with the ten of ones and the six of swords magician card because you're not receiving the energy and you keep working on your energy cleaning up your energy and all these things connecting with your ancestors these this someone is just really afraid victim they are afraid something is gonna bite them back is the energy for real i'm t i'm not even playing vanity because this person was focused on the wrong thing who is this person angel spirits guides i'm telling you this person is like on the on the ready to get their karma it's like it's like loaded and ready and they probably have been experiencing it already so they want to come to you and go please you know please don't even though they've been the one <laughs> service so this person could be i like some type of um i hear skilled hmm. they were like deliberately targeting you in some way right now they are caught up and there is no one to protect them that's how i feel like there is no one to shelter them because all of the little bodyguards that they had you already ate their food and now all of your ancestors are standing with you like um tiger eye or something like that right you're just so dominant and beautiful you are now embodying magician energy because you've taken all of your power back 
this person and they did it behind your back too mm -hmm. guilt someone they did it behind your back someone was trying to um break this one's an unscrupulous person unscrupulous vibrations and scrupulous corporate um entities you know and they they don't like the taste of their medicine they don't like to feel the heat on them they don't like the hot seat they don't really like it right i'm telling you they like they just want your forgiveness they want reconciliation they want you to be calm with them but i'm t this person just be use your discernment because the six of swords is trust as well with the instincts card use your discernment because if this person puts you through so much i feel like if you're not looking the next time you're not looking they're gonna try to like completely you know <laughs> do whatever they started and i feel like you know like i said view these messages as your entertainment okay so you've got to keep this person at some type of a distance from you like i hear suss them out right give them a, a, a rope like some length from your your life like it's going to this thing where i don't trust you as far as i can throw you or something like that grief yeah and you're on your healing journey and so that's your you're a light worker and so these people saw that you had value resources in your life. So they thought that they would come and use off of yours, take from you, uh, um, benefit from you, and then put you through struggling. I'm telling you, you were dealing with someone that was really vindictive, unscrupulous, and evil. And then it's so weird that when they're when it's you're working on yourself and you're taking your power back, no, they want to act like innocent and they want to act like, oh, I can feel pain. Please don't don't do something to me oh my it's that energy i want to paint it so you get what i'm saying it's that energy this person may work they work in some service field maybe public service they really don't like the heat all right and you're coming in so strong you're coming in strong so this could be just you speaking your truth someone is like please i know please don't do this i know i've done all these things to you but please don't talk about it please don't expose it yeah but if they got the chance because they're so afraid if ever they get the chance for sure they would want to like keep you quiet at first they were like trying to keep you quiet and make you struggle and laugh at you and think it's poke at you and think it's all fun and joke you know like know that they see you have complete power and that you are so dominant and rich and successful and strong in your faith, in your energy, in your physical body, in your mind, in your money-making abilities, your self-sufficiency, you don't need them. No, this person is like, well, maybe I, I instead, like, instead of me getting back what I was doing to that person is what they're saying. They would just rather not benefit from you any at all and move on. Right? <laughs> Nine of diamonds. But I feel like they cannot. Someone cannot take you for granted any longer. You're just protected. The Nine of Diamonds is giving me an energy of protective energy around you. You're impenetrable. You're, you're forced to be reckoned with. You think your own. You feel your own thoughts. You feel your own way. You provide for yourself. And that's why someone thought that. Someone, yeah, someone didn't expect that. Six of Cups. Someone, something about roses or getting your flowers. And I feel self-love in your day-to-day -day destiny. You are so inspiring also that even like certain people that didn't believe in you, certain people that grouped up against you, the ones that were gossiping about you too, now they are going to try to move toward you. I'm telling you, growth. Because they're seeing growth, progress, prosperity, love in your life, and they're seeing that you are what they need. You are what they need. So they're coming crawling back to you. So this message is for you to know how powerful you are and claim that power. You are at the head of the table. You're not at the foot of the table. You're not begging for views. You're not begging for attention. You're not scraping by. You're at the head of the, um, the table. But they wanted it to seem the other way around. So when you hold your position and claim your position, you realize that you are sitting at the head and they're coming to your table. You could be like sitting on your throne, you're the king, you're risen, you're the queen. And so these people want to come to you for advice. You could be a spiritual advisor or something. But it was, like I said, it was written that you are um, like a sage, a seer, a, a psychic, a channeler, a truth teller. 
now the <laughs> you've claimed your power so beautifully that nothing can mess with you these people just have to recognize with the destiny card like how they come how they approach you is different you may be getting you may be a movie star i'm getting that pop star movie star okay and um be mindful of this trick record again of these people that say they want to come around to but i feel like you're so smart they say they want to move around to you but at the same time they have something up their sleeves so suss these people out breathe in don't rush to do anything be that dominant prominent person that have been through so much that you're not taking any chances just protect yourself keep loving yourself too. eat well 